So point number one, know your worth, know your worth. And so what is the going rate for your time, right? As a business owner, what we do in the maid service world is we sell time, right? That's, that's all we have to sell. We don't sell products. We sell time. I was actually talking to somebody yesterday about this concept and we did a little bit of math. And what we did was we structured out. I said, write this down and let's do some math. Grab your calculator. I asked them what they charge for like a typical bi-weekly client. And he gave me an example of a house that they had just done. He had just done that morning. And he said, I charge 140 bucks for this house. They are every other week. And he said, when I clean this house all by myself, he said, I can clean it in two hours flat. And he said, I can bill out $70 per labor hour as a solo cleaner, as a highly incentivized business owner, right? Uh, he said, I can do it in two hours and I can average 70 an hour. But normally I assign that job to my team. And he said his team of three will take an hour and a half to clean that same job that he can do all by himself in two hours flat. And if you do the math, I mean, the client still pays 140 bucks, right? If a team of three spends 1.5 hours on that job, then you have to times one and a half hours times three people. So that's a contribution of four and a half labor hours on that job for $140. He makes like $31 an hour when his staff cleans. His company is receiving over 70 an hour when he cleans. What is your time worth? Is your, is your time worth more than 30 or 35 or 34 an hour? I'm so